Okay, let's move on to our next trending story. President of the Senate, Dr. Abubakar Bukola Saraki, said yesterday or reiterated the resolve of the Eighth Senate to continue to protect and defend the nation's fledging democracy. A statement released by his chief press secretary, Sani Onogu in Abuja, yesterday notes that Saraki said this during a meeting with chairmen and also leaders of 45 registered political parties who had paid him what they called, quote-unquote, a solidarity visit. At the meeting, which was broadcast live on Facebook as well, Saraki told the party leaders, led by the national chairman of the Democratic United Party, Perry Okpara, that as direct representatives of the people, lawmakers will continue to play their role to ensure that the rule of law is followed and that human rights are respected in the country. <laughs> How do we take this? I got a bit, um, I got a bit scared, shall I say, when I saw that headline today that the president of the Senate has met with leaders of 45 of Nigeria's 68 political parties. Which is not a bad thing, no. No, it's not. But the problem is, it's a solidarity visit. Thank you. I'm happy. I hope they were singing solely, 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 <laughs> solidarity <laughs> for her. Solely, solely, solely. And as they were going, her. maybe they were solely, solely, <laughs> solely solidarity for her. <laughs> <laughs> we shall always <laughs> fight for our rights. rights. <laughs> You know what? Your right is here. Your, your, your right is now. It's here now. That, your right is. It depends on where your own right is. Oh. Some people, this is where their right is. Or when they receive, bing, 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 bing. That's why they spare right. Spare right. Bing, 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 bing. That's the only way they spare right. Or can you spare right? The person just tell you, um, oh, zero one, one, zero four one, nine one, nine. two, two, please. Uh, don't make a mistake. It's a good to code it. Then you tell you, you see. See, we have always complained that our political parties are a twiddle-dum and twiddle That is, they are Peter and Paul, or Taya and Kende, because you cannot tell any difference. And that is because they do not have any ideology. I have had the opportunity, maybe because of this business, and people have spoken to, to look at the political parties in Nigeria. And I will tell you point blank that I can count on my fingers political parties that have, a, that have an ideology that you can attach to principles. That's why somebody will be... Uh, this political party in the morning and that political party in the afternoon and tell you I'm doing this because of my people. Which people? Which people? Who have you helped? Village people. Which people? Well, I'm doing this because of my people. See, Nigerians need to understand that I'm, go I'm going to be honest here. Our system is not ideal. Our system is warped. Our system is unstable. And those that benefit from an unstable system will not make you, will, will do all that they can to see that they supplant whatever means you seek to upturn that system for good. Because it's, it's to the advantage. Chukudi, do you think that it has anything to do with the way our democracy is set up? Let me ask you why. The other day on radio, Lulu White, an ethical advocate in South Africa, stated that African democracy is not working. This was it with regards to electoral violence, by the way, but it can still apply in context here. The African democracy is not working because we, we basically copied and pasted Western democracy and expected it to sit with every single people and culture on the continent. Well, Do you I, think that we have a long-term <clears throat> problem here with the way our democracy is I like, I like is to look at issues, you know, in context. Mm. The truth is, if we go by the popular definition or generally accepted definition, I know there are different scholars who would say, okay, this is the angle I, I look at it from. But the essence of democracy is all is inclusivity, everybody participating, or majority. We cannot all share the same opinion, but majority, that's democracy. Abraham Lincoln, government of the people, by the people, and for the people. But what we have in Nigeria today, and that's why certain people look at Africa and say, no, 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 no. The truth is, you use a system that works with how special or how unique your society is. But let's be truthful to ourselves now. These people that are telling us, oh, uh, the reason why our democracy, well, they, they have property abroad, they send their children abroad, they get the very best of education, the very best of Medicare, but when they come to Nigeria, they cause confusion. Have you ever seen a Nigerian public office holder that will go to America or Germany or France or Russia and jump the queue? Never. <laughs> even, if, even, if, even if his name is, even if his name is Honorable Senator, this, 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 but when he gets outside the country, he puts all no, no, do you know what his name will turn to? CDQ. Because you always see the queue. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Today is not Friday. Today is not Wednesday. Uh, no, but it's Friday yeah, now. I didn't jokes and uh, you know, as an ex-governor, you understand? <laughs> you, so many, you have seen so many things. So you can say so many things. <laughs> to enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch. 
press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.